Over the past two days, we have learned of other extremely disturbing developments, including physical assaults on and intimidation and arbitrary detention of dozens of journalists in what is clearly a blatant attempt to stifle news of what is going on in Egypt. All journalists and all human rights defenders who were arrested for practicing their professions must be released immediately and unconditionally. The authorities must order their security and intelligence forces to cease this extreme harassment at once. I also urge the authorities to maintain open communications and internet services, protect media premises, and halt all activities aimed at restricting or manipulating the free flow of information, such as uh, the extraordinary hijacking of Vodafone's system in order to send propaganda text messages. I strongly condemn the uh, attacks and the arbitrary detention of journalists, uh, their treatment, by security agents and military checkpoints. This behavior is outrageous and illegal. The role of the media is vital and the authorities must facilitate their work and take concrete actions to prevent further assaults against them. And above all, remove all impediments for the f free flow of information. And so I uh, also listened with great surprise the, dep the um, vice president attributing blame to the international media. It was clear to all of us that we would have not uh, had um, such excellent uh, exposure to what's happening while it's happening had it not been for the international media. And so really a very strong call from me for um, respect for the media and that they be allowed to continue to function freely. Thank you.